The new FAA bill will catapult our air traffic control system into a high-tech era where pilots and air traffic controllers will use GPS and satellites instead of outdated radars to steer our planes. Everybody knows they're smart cars because you see it in the GPS system. Well, this is going to be about having smart planes. We wanted to see for ourselves how this new technology works, so we tracked down a pilot willing to show us. We took to the skies with flight instructor Dave Hodas, whose plane is equipped with a new onboard satellite system. It quickly picked up on all the traffic in the air. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five other airplanes. Planes I couldn't spot with the naked eye. The system also tells Dave what direction the other planes are heading and how high they're flying. Now you know that they're out there, and so now you realize, seeing this technology, like, wow, this is, I'm definitely a lot safer now having this. The 12 planes at Dave's Flying School have this new technology. Under the FAA bill, all planes need to have it by 2020. The bill also requires airports install GPS systems to allow planes to take off and land closer together. Now they have to space them a certain distance apart because their radar is only so accurate. A thousand feet up, visibility was good, but as we found out, our eyes are no match for technology. Outside Washington, I'm Carol Hahn.